to rest in my office for a few moments, sir. We'll uh, get a car to take you home. Here we are. Please don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. We'll look after him. Just uh, carry on with the game. Hmm? I was right. Please. Special branch. What time is the contact due? Midnight, precisely. That only gives us a couple of minutes. No, there's no need to panic. When the contact shows up, we'll make the payment just as arranged. With him around? Well, he won't be. I want you to take him out the back way, find somewhere nice and quiet and lose him. I'll look after things here. Good luck, Sam. Thanks very much. Now, this is what we're going to do. We're going to play for a half hour. Win, draw, lose, whatever we could, okay? All right, Daniel. As long as you understand it, it's only half an hour for me. Got it. Because you can do what you wish, I am going back to the hotel for some well-deserved sleep. You deserve it. Two hundred pounds, please. Boy, look at this club. Really jumping, huh? Right again. Good evening, Good evening gentlemen. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> if you haven't guessed already, my friend has no resistible urge to gamble. Yes. Roulette? Roulette? Of course. Well, please ask for anything you want, and uh, good luck. I don't need luck. i got a system. I play all the odd red numbers. Right this way, sir. Thank you. Faites vos jeux, madame, monsieur. Faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Bonsoir. Bonsoir, monsieur. Vos jeux, s'il vous plaît, madame, monsieur. 19, monsieur. Make it seven. I mean, 19. 19, monsieur. Faites vos jeux, madame, monsieur, s'il vous plaît. Faites vos jeux. Rien ne va plus, monsieur. Dix-neuf, rouge, un père et passe. Five hundred and twenty-five pounds. Yeah, and a little swat.
Fletcher. Full of boys. Thank you. Have you found a way of cheating at roulette? You wouldn't believe what's been happening here. I can't do any more. Watch this. <laughs> uh, nine. Nine. No. Hey, rien ne va plus, s'il vous plaît. Rien. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bravo, 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 I love it, I love it, it. I love it. Now, winner, why don't you end up a winner, Dad? I'm going to be a winner You have broken all the laws of science and physics, of magic, mysticism and chance. Now, please, tomorrow you're thanks. Oh, come on, Brett, let's play a little longer. What do you say? For once in my life, sincerely, Daniel, I would like to see someone with a perfect record of straight wins pick up okay. their money and leave. Okay, 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 just calm down and we'll leave. leave. I am calm. Here, here, take, take these, will you? All right, hold on. Thank we'll you, just Dad. make a little bet for the uh, for tips. Yeah, uh, yeah, Excusez-moi, yeah. 25, please. 25, yes. Yeah. No more bets. Yes. Rien ne va plus. Rien ne va plus. I'm going to marry you. Vingt-six noirs, père et passe. Oh, well. Say la guerre. You're winning, sir. I beg your pardon? Twenty-six, Ken. No, no, I bet twenty-five. Oh, well, I must have misheard you, sir. I accepted your bet for twenty-six. Oh, you did, huh? I'm misfortune. Thank you very much. I'll take it. I don't believe it. Yes, please. Thank you. I'm spoiled. Thank you. Let me help you, sir. Yes, please. Go ahead. Yeah, this is for the boys. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm spoiled. Come on, Daniel. Cash all these in, please, yes, John. Hello. I have identified the contact. He'll be leaving in a minute. Thank you. And 200, sir. Everything in order, Sam? Yeah, perfect, perfect. Thank you very much. Uh, good night. Good night. Good night. Say good night, night. Stanley. Good night. He did more. Yes. Good night. Good night. Oh, gentlemen. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Are you the manager? Yes. Can I help you? My name is Heather. I'm a little late. Oh, there's plenty of time, sir. All the tables are open. Enjoy yourself and uh, good luck. Oh, I don't need luck. I've got a system. I play all the odd red numbers. Well, we've all got our own little systems. Did you say you were late? Yes. I also said I play all the odd red numbers. What time are you supposed to be here? Midnight. Into my office quickly. Don't be a fool. You just do as I say. That American who just left, get after him. Why? He'll just get after him. I think I'm going to buy me a bank. Daniel, you could buy Brighton if you want to, but tomorrow, huh? Mm-hmm. I paid him out. I just followed my instructions. He gave me the key phrase. I don't need luck. I've got a system. I play all the odd red numbers. But the second phrase. 19. Make it 7. I mean 19. He used it. Word for word. But you should have checked. How? How? I don't know anybody. I don't know you. And we're not even supposed to talk to each other. Just let me tell you what you've done. But you're the one that was late. Shut up! By collecting a big win here tonight, I would have identified myself as the network paymaster. Somebody was watching for me. That somebody would then contact me and name the place where I am to meet all our key agents in Britain. But you didn't collect. But the American did. They'll tell him. Can't you get it into your head? You've not only lost 50,000 pounds, you've blown our entire network. Your Lordship, after a hit like this, we ought to have a party. Mm. 
Do you know anybody here in Brighton? Any girls? No. Give or take a hundred, about fifty. Fifty? Mm -hmm. Ha, it'll be a small party. Just you, me, and the fifty girls. Oh, 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 oh. What are you sitting down in the bed for? What are you going to do now? I'm removing my shoes. Are you going to bed? Exactly. Well, we're supposed to celebrate tonight. Daniel, it took the Romans a thousand years of decadence and debauchery to bring about their decline and fall. So what, so what? Well, what took them a thousand years is taking us three days and three nights. There's your stiff upper lip, kid. Right below my bloodshot eyes. You so long. I had to get this from the car. Which is the American's room? Here, yeah, but he's still in there with his buddy. Good. Get the door open. Did you uh, call Riker? Yes. He'll be out the front in about five minutes. Fix the bug. You take care of this. What are you doing? I am uh, taking up my pills. What are you going to take a pill for? Mm, to sleep. Sleep? Mm -hmm. I am going to have 12 Solid, uh, drink without us. What about the party? Boy, you, uh, you start without me, will you? Excuse me, what are you looking for now? Look, Charles. They're over there. Mm. How the mighty have fallen. Oh, whatever happened to you? Remember the good old days? You were, in a, you were an eagle. Soar around. No, Jim Jams. Now you're a chicken. That should do it. Why are we going to all this trouble? Why don't we just fix him? It's vital we find out who the contact is. Vital to the whole network. Once we know that, then the American must be eliminated. What about the money? That must look like straightforward robbery. Riker's outside. I'll just check this. Everything's set. Just waiting for him. If you're receiving me loud and clear, flash your lights. That's okay. Get ready. Here you are, my pal. Take this. Salute. Oh, well. You can't win them all, I guess. Good night, sweet prince, your lordship. Rest well. See you in the morning. Don't let the big bugs bite. to come to your party.
please look at me when I'm talking. Oh! Stuff problems everywhere, Now is no time to go to sleep. Hey. Hey, your lordship. Will you wake up? Come on. There's no place to fall asleep now. Oh, come on, kid. I don't want to. Betty, bye. No, Let's go. Let me get you to your bed. Oh. 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 Mr. White. Uh, yes, come in, please. Uh, room service must have sent you. Now, don't leave. Let me get rid of this bundle for Britain, and I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Just don't leave. Oh. Hello. Sorry, the room's such a mess, but uh, that's the way it goes. But all this morning. Well, easy come, easy go. Now, what can I do for you? Well, you know who I am, don't you? Tell me. I am Section 7. Section 7? Oh, nice. Nice to meet you, Section 7. <laughs> you do understand, don't you? Oh, I understand everything, Section 7, darling. Here, come over here and sit down. Take off your scarf and stay a few minutes. Oh, there is no time for that. Oh, we don't have any time, I see. Here is our schedule. Our oh, schedule? I mean, we're working to a schedule of some kind? Of course. Oh. Well, we Americans are efficient, but this is ridiculous. Tomorrow I will come and give you instructions. Uh, Section 7, I don't need any instructions. It's okay. Thank you, but... Uh... How else will you know what to do? Uh, I got a feeling we're not talking of the same thing. Sit down, Section 7. There is no time for social niceties. Oh, I'm sorry. Just read the schedule and then destroy it. Would, uh, would you like me to eat it? Old-fashioned, but quite effective. Well, that's what I am. Old-fashioned, but quite effective. Please. We have no time for that type of frivolous bourgeois relationship. Oh, we don't? No. Oh, I see. Besides, it is not permitted between someone of your rank and his Section 7. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I must go now. Yes, well, uh, maybe I'll... Uh, maybe the elevator. Will you, uh... Wait a minute. Get over to the entrance and follow the girl. He's baffled for the moment. But it won't take him long to work it out. What are you going to do? Eliminate. That's all we can do. Is he explosive in position? Yes. All right, give me the detonator. Section 7, please. Listen, I'm Section 8. Oh, I see. Well, come on, you can't sleep here in the hallway like this. Where are we going? Come on, I'm going to take you to my room and I'll just sleep there. No, no, no. What are you talking about? It's as quiet as a graveyard. Come on. Problem, Daniel? What You're out of condition. Oh, you think you so? You need huh? a good night's sleep. Well, I'd get a good night's sleep if someone wasn't trying to bump me off. I don't think it's personal. Oh, no. Well, that makes me feel better, I'll tell it's you. It's money. Money? Somebody's trying to bar me out of a room for my money? <laughs> you have a point. Yeah. What about the girl? Section 7. Well, what's she want? I'll tell you what she doesn't want. It's all crazy to me. That's what it is. I don't understand. Well, we'll just have to wait until they try to kill you again. Then we'll ask them. Well, I'm not sitting around they... waiting for anybody to try to kill me well, again. Daniel, I, uh... I don't think you'll have to wait. No, don't, don't look, look around. I said don't look around. There have been two men following us ever since we started out. Look uh, casual. Oh, is this casual enough for you? Not that casual. Would you look out to see? Beautiful view. Yeah, beautiful. On second thoughts, I uh, think it might be quite a good idea if we did talk to them. I'll talk to anybody. Not here. Follow me, Democrat.
County Constabulary. Uh, Daniel! Daniel! What? Pulse! Pulse! Where? Where? Here, here, here! Oh, 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 I'm terribly sorry. Please forgive me. I really didn't mean anything by that. It was just Excuse that... Me, but you, 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 were, you uh, were following us. Yes, exactly. Just trying to keep observation on you. Until you got to your meeting. Uh, the meeting? We're going to what meeting is that there? The one we're taking you to now. Oh, the one we're... Uh, yes. We oh, yes, by all means, please. Terribly sorry. Please forgive uh, Lead on. Yes, by all... Thank you. Any further? We're going to be in France. Here we are. Inside. Thank you. Excuse us, won't you? Dustin Hoffman. Martha Ray. She's pretty, isn't Dustin? You think so? I'll tell you. Well, I'm going to tell you something. You look. You look better in the mirror. Yes. How do you do? Good of you to come. Hello. <clears throat> Dean, Sir Maxwell Dean. Wild Sinclair. <laughs> Here, have some of these. Enjoy yourselves. <clears throat> Did you have us brought here? Not brought, dear chap. Invited. Try the crane or the um, ice hockey machine. Uh, great fun. What kind of fuzz are you? Oh, a bit of everything. We wanted to chat to you about your visit to the gaming club. Any money I win in England gambling is tax-free, buddy. Lucky chap. Question is, will you live to enjoy it? Excuse me, if you know this much, why aren't you arresting people? Not a shred of evidence. We would have had, but things didn't quite work out last night. Oh, somebody goofed, huh? Yes. You, Mr. Wilde. The money you won last night should have been paid to a foreign agent, a man we know only as the paymaster. He would then have distributed the cash to a network of agents throughout this country. You mean that uh, somebody's been mistaking me for this uh, paymaster? It would seem so, yes. By the time they discovered their mistake, it was too late. A pity. A great pity. Uh, please forgive me if I jump to conclusions and correct me if I'm wrong. I'm sure you will. Your intention was, or is, to follow the paymaster and thereby get the whole network. Something like that. Ah. Unfortunately, the man we'd planted in the club was found dead this morning. A carefully staged accident. Mm -hmm. Now we have only one possible lead. Oh. <clears throat> Forget it. I'm not leading anybody anywhere, anytime. I don't think you appreciate the importance of your part in all this. These men work in cells. The men who run the club would have no idea of the identity of the other agents. Now, last night, a total stranger to the club would have identified you as the paymaster simply because you won the money. That person will make contact. Has made contact. Really? A girl. Hey, whose side are you on anyway? England's. Well, you don't listen to him, please. Uh, uh, excuse me, but I think you've got the wrong guy because I, I could get killed. No, oh, almost certainly. The real paymaster's bound to try to eliminate you. Well, what are you staying here playing with this machine for? You're an inspector or somebody in the fuzz. Go out and arrest him. Do uh, something. We will, we will. Unfortunately, we won't know who he is until after he's killed you. Oh, do you hear this? Excuse me, but I'm leaving. I'm leaving the country. Goodbye. We do need your help, and I can offer you protection. No. I must warn you, working for us or not, you'll be a target. The fastest moving target you ever saw in your life, starting now. Adios, amigos. Goodbye. Not very British. Oh, understandable. From the colonies, you know. You will let me know where you are, won't you? Yeah, I'll let you. You're going to stay? Of course I am. You know my insatiable curiosity. All yeah, right, well... When you find out what it's all about, you can let me know. Yes. Drive carefully and remember the left-hand side of the road, Inning. Don't move. Just keep absolutely still. Don't turn off your ignition. What is it? Have you, uh, you had any work done on this car since you've been here? No, none at all. Why? You think you could open your bonnet very carefully? I want to look at the engine. 
It's not a bonnet. It's a hood. You're a hood, Daniel. Would you open it? Yeah, I will, but it's in the back. Barn cars. What is it? Daniel, I... Uh, I have some bad news for you. What? Now, I want you to be very brave and take it like a man. My living stereo is dead, huh? You're, uh, sitting in an enormous bomb. Sit still. I don't know how it's wired in yet. There may be a trembler in it. I'll say there's a trembler. It's me. There's all sorts of bits of electronic equipment around. Go get an expert. There may not be time. You see, by turning on the ignition, you may have activated the fuse. Now, it could be any one of a dozen systems. All I have to do is find the detonator. Do you know anything about this? Well, I, uh, I took a course on it once in the army. How did you do? I failed. Oh. Why don't you run for your life? Get out of here as quickly as you can. Will you beat it? Daniel, I've got it. Now, it's uh, just a question of whether I turn it right or left. Well, what do you think? Well, uh, I think right. Turn it left. All right. Brace yourself. Faint. By the way, you can get out now. All right, that's it. One bomb was all right, but two bombs. That makes me mad. I'm staying. You're going to work for some Maxwell? No. I'm going to work for myself. Here. Oh. I should have let him drive off. We wouldn't be in this state if that moron of yours had tailed the girl. She's smart. She spotted him right away. Knew how to lose him, too. All right, all right. Well, we'll need to change plans slightly. We'll need Wild alive a little while longer. Well, just as well. That cat's got nine lives anyway. I have to know the contact before I can move. Why do you do that? There is a way. Leave that to me. After that, Wild dies. And I'll make sure we make a proper job of it this time. Well, it just doesn't make any sense to me. I mean, this just is a list of names of towns. It could be incurred. Well, no, I don't think so. She said it was some kind of a schedule. Well, maybe you're supposed to visit every town on the list. Hmm? That'd take me a week and a half. Besides, I don't know who or where. Look, what are you supposed to be? Would you believe a brain surgeon? No, you look like a window cleaner to me. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, that's what you're supposed to be, a mm -hmm, window cleaner? Mm -hmm. Well, I'll tell you something. You don't fool me. People who don't know you are going to be able to recognize you. Well, that's the whole point, Daniel. Nobody ever looks at a window cleaner, and I have to get into that club somehow, because that is where it all started. Well, I'm going to come along with you. Oh, you can't. Why not? Well, because if that girl wishes to make contact, this is the only place she will come. Oh, well, wait a minute. Here. Here, I made a copy of this list for you. Maybe you can make some sense out of it when you get a chance. Sherlock, why don't you take the first letter of each town and maybe you can make a name of it? Oh, here, let me open that for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. See you later, kid. Barakshka Frickblatt. A stupid chance. Not really. Wilder's never seen Heather. And he's expecting somebody. He'll be expecting the girl. So he'll say there's a change of plan. i tell you something. Heather's a pro. He'll handle Wilde. Well, we'll know soon enough. Should be at the hotel by now. Where are you going? I think I'll walk across to the hotel, see how things are going on. All right. You going to be here? I so. I'll call you if anything comes up.
just one moment. No, 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 no. I, I cannot speak any louder. I do not have laryngitis. <laughs> Sunny Vaughn. Oh, your germs is gone. When you use Sunny Vaughn. Hello? Oh, yes, yes. It's for you. <laughs> Who's your ladder? going a little too far. I mean, I was going to tip you. Stand up, Mr. Wilde. Now sit down. Keep your hands in sight. Good. Now we'll wait for your contact to arrive. Uh, and when she does? When she does, your part in this will come to an abrupt and tragic end. I'm just going to put this away. You, uh, you really should stop worrying. I'm going to end up with ulcers. I had a, a great great uncle, the 17th or was the 16th? Anyway, 16th Duke. You know, I really would appreciate it if you'd stop talking. You sound exactly like a friend of mine, Danny Wilde. Anyway, the 17th Duke was an absolute. <laughs> you even begin to act like Danny. The money? Oh, it's right here. Thank you. Thank you. You'll find it all there. I didn't spend any. A couple of tips, but that's all. Good, thank you. Are you the uh, guy that was supposed to collect it? Uh, yes, I was delayed. Uh, well, then there's no hard feelings, is there? You got your money? Why don't we just shake hands and... Well, that would be nice, but I wouldn't know where to go. Oh, I see. That's the beauty of the cell system. Oh, it is? Even if I was caught and tortured, I couldn't give anyone away. I'm completely in the hands of my contact. What happens if uh, my contact doesn't show? <laughs> she just showed Right, now let's get this clear. You open the door, right. and then you stand to one side, right? Please, hurry to be ready. We have little time. Yes, I'll just tidy up. We'll go right along. Yes, absolutely. You to fool around with love this guy. What do you think you're doing? I kill him, yes? No, you don't kill him. Why would you want to kill him? As you please, but killing is better. Where did you learn these kind of things? Killing is your... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Here, hold this. Killing and shooting. You're going to be crazy to want it. There you go again with the gun. Didn't they give you dolls to play with when you were a kid? The guns. You're crazy. <laughs> anyway, when they opened the old Duke up, it wasn't ulcers at all. You see, it was really Get a dodge. The car. Bring it around to the back. Right. It was a freak of nature. Is this what they say, is it? I'm afraid so. I don't have time to make a short, but passionate little plea about man's inhumanity to man. Well, I'd rather you didn't. Oh, well, in that case. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bad form, hitting a handcuffed prisoner. Uh, snap. 
Oh, hadn't you noticed? They're not from Cartier's. Would you do me the honours, please? How did you know I was here? I've known for hours. Oh. I couldn't move until your friend left with the contact. Oh, and uh, is he on his way? Yes. Dropped the car under surveillance. They're all professionals. That wretched girl won't have the faintest idea she's being followed. We are being followed. Do you think it's that van? I use them. I'm very expert. Well, you certainly are. What is the tail? This is Green Dolphin to Blue Whale. She's seen you. Drop out. Red Mullet, stand by and take over. You lost them. The intelligence services of the capitalists are most inferior. I'll say they are. You lost them, would you? Will you tell me, please, where we're going? Green off into Red Mullet. Stay in position until next intersection. Golden Carp, stand by to take over from Red Mullet. Don't worry, she can't make a move without us knowing about it. It's odd, you know. What is? And they're staying well within the town limits. Sir? Well, you said you thought they'd be heading for a secret rendezvous somewhere. I'm certain of it. Green Dolphin, all units, anybody in contact? Negative. No contact. Uh, negative. What was your last position? Well, that's it. They lost your tail here and have made for the railway station. This is Green Dolphin. All units converge on Brighton Central. Check all trains for suspects. Fast. Well, now this makes sense. I thought it was just a list of towns, a list of railway stations. Brighton, Worthing, Barnum, Chichester, Haven't, Fair. That's the Exeter line. Find out what time the next train leaves for Exeter. Why didn't you give me this before? Well, if you remember, I was a prisoner of war at the time. Next train to Exeter. The moon train. The perfect rendezvous. Exeter train left two minutes ago, sir. Give me Whitehall. Recall all units. Set up charts covering the Exeter lines. Yes, sir. As quick as you can. Whitehall. Now you'll see just how efficient we can be. Oh, damn it. Now we've lost him. Comrade, or may I call you Section 7? You may call me Lynn. Oh. Short for Natasha Lynn. Well, Natasha Lynn, am I the senior uh, comrade here? Of course. Well, put your book down. I want to know where we're going. Don't give me any of business with the nose. Very well, I answer. We are going nowhere. Where? I explain we are going nowhere because we are already there. There? Where? Here. Oh. Yes, it's all right. Very curious man, Mr. Wyatt. For an agent, I mean. Oh, I see. Well, it's uh, part of my cover. I mean, who would take me for a spy? True. Yeah. But you seem to have such capitalist taste. Oh. You live in luxury hotel, you drink champagne, you have expensive clothes. Yeah, well, do you think I enjoy it? I mean, traveling first class, eating in the finest restaurants, driving expensive cars. I hate it. It's torture. Torture. I do it for the cause, you see. It must be terrible. Well, I try to be brave.
time to go. Go where? There. Chinese restaurant. Comrade. Comrade. This is our comrade from the north. It is an honor to meet you, comrade. Comrade, it's an honor to meet you as well. Thank you so much. The others will be here at 30 second intervals. Make sure you check them. Yes, comrade. Comrade. Wonderful to see you. Excuse me, madam. <laughs> like a lot of chicken feed, I'll tell you that. I have a list of the amounts due to our people. And if you don't mind, I'd like to pay them out if they arrive. Right, comrade. Absolutely. Anything you say, sir. And Miss. then you can begin your briefing. Yes. My briefing. Oh. We are looking forward to that very much. Yes. Well, I'm looking forward to my briefing as well. Time we had a visit from one of your lads. Well, I try to move around as much as I can, meet everybody. Nice to meet you, kid. Nice to meet you. Hey, what's this then? He's a Yank, isn't he? I think you mean that our comrade appears to be an American. Oh, yeah. Just the same. I don't like this breaking cover. Uh, I don't like breaking cover myself, to tell you the truth. I don't like it at all. It better be worth it. Yeah, right. It better be worth it, boy, because I don't like breaking my cover. Come on. Oh, uh, delighted, old boy. Delighted. This is our comrade from London. <laughs> Where else? Of course. <laughs> uh, dreadful train. You think so? Food's appalling. Well, it's that's And as for the service. Yes, sir. It really is about time we had another rail strike, you know. Oh, yeah, you think so, huh? Yes. Well, uh, not today, though. I mean, today we're on the train and we're traveling. Not today, so. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Punctuality, I. I like that. Will there be any changes in our targets for this year, or will it be much the same? Uh, no, the targets this year should be about the same, give or take a little one way or the other. What did you say, Copper? Yeah, I said give or take, just a little bit, one way or the other. A little but fast. I thought that. <laughs> So, what do you think about our effort then? Oh, your effort is an excellent one. Not bad for a small unit, oh, eh? Oh, wonderful for a small unit, excellent. 100,000 men on strike for five weeks. Yeah, right. That's 20 million man hours down oh, the chute, you know. That's a lot of men down the chute, isn't it? Yeah. Not to mention the exports. The exports? Yeah, right. What do you mean by the exports? Well, the exports versus the imports. I mean, that's the logistics of the economy, don't you oh, see? One yeah. kind of balancing the yeah. other. You have a point there, yes, brother. absolutely. Oh, here comes another comrade. Excuse me, please. Comrade. 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 Now, watch your head, Comrade. 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 Here's the last one. Now you can begin your briefing, huh? Right. Why don't you say a few words before my briefing, because my briefing is going to need a few words. And so I give you Comrade Brad. Bravo. Comrades. 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 This is a moving moment for me, believe me. What a great honor to be here with you all. Up to now, you've been nothing but numbers to me. Numbers in a file, 603, 907. Now you're real and live. Brothers, sisters, comrades. Comrades! 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 Ah. comrades.
Comrad. Yes. I think you should begin your briefing now. Mm -hmm. We have little time. Now, what briefing is that? Oh, the briefing. Yes, yes, of course, certainly. The briefing. I'm sorry, this is the end of the train, sir. Oh. Well, see that? That's the end of my fist. Oh. Thank you. You've just saved me the trouble. Up slowly. Now unlock the door. Try harder. Whatever you're doing, try harder. If you're striking, strike harder. If you're protesting, protest harder. Whatever. Don't move. There is only one network paymaster, and I'm he. But this is the paymaster I saw him with. What, you don't really believe that, do you? Oh, yes, she believes it. <laughs> I don't think we need that again. So, put down the axe. Now, what did I do to you? That's yes, a very good question, Just Daniel. put down the axe. Well, think of the mess it'll make. <laughs> there, there, there. Feel better? Oh, the most extraordinary creatures. Yeah. <laughs> I need hardly say that Her Majesty's government is exceedingly grateful for your part in this affair. Naturally, we should like to show our appreciation in some material way. However, as this all comes under the Official Secrets Act, that won't be possible. So instead, please accept a very warm handshake. Thank you so much, and my best uh, wishes to you. Handshake, Sir Maxwell? You accuse my friend of being un-British, but I think you're being extremely un-British. Oh. What about his £50,000? Oh, it's all right. A mere flea bite, Daniel. £50,000. That's easy, come. It's the principle. Easy, go. It doesn't make I, any difference. I, you invested you, money. You're entitled to you, win. You put too much importance on uh, things like that. Anyway, I mean, uh, you, 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 shouldn't, that uh, you shouldn't take it so to heart, you know what I mean? You uh, should just uh, let these things happen as they do. If you win, you win. If you lose, you'll... <clears throat> you'll lose. Would you, uh, Daniel, I... I'm beginning to get the oddest sensation. Well, I tell you, I uh, do believe that you are on the beginning of what we might call one of your lucky streaks. Daniel, the, oh, I wouldn't. Oh. Oh. No more. Don't use any more of your luck. Yes. We have bigger fish to fry. Excuse us. Goodbye. Oh. Arrivederci, Roma. And Monte Carlo. Yes. Right and clear. Now the world. <laughs>